Why does it say continue still? No save data found. Okay, cool. We did it, lads. All right. Teach me how to be good at video games. Should I go like full melee strong? Strong melee character? Ranged? I want to take tracking and botany. Although I've heard tra um, I've heard trapping. Tracking is not that good. I've heard. But trapping is very good. I like tracking and botany. I feel like hiding is good. Um, I think athletic can be good if you want to do like a mad dash for the glow. Two of the best skills for new players, so you did well with those. Nice. I'm kind of thinking medic for the last one. Or ranged. Plus trapping. Grog, strong, and eat meat. Look how much strong costs, though. It's a ridiculous amount. Athletics is better than hiding. Does athletic trump hiding? Like, if I have athletics, should I not take hiding? Strong is solid. It's, it's solid, but it's also six. Uh, I think Eagle Eye is good, isn't it? Doesn't Eagle Eye, like, let you find the, uh, the multi-tool early on? High metabolism is actually a positive trait. It's both a positive and a negative. I could take, like, Eagle Eye and Metabolism. If you take Trapping and Botany, take the Metabolism Flaw, you'll be able to keep up with the food and water needs easily with Trapping and Botany and Metabolism Flaw buffs. Heals a lot. Myopia and High Metabolism equals free point. Can see one hex less than normal and detecting hidden creatures is harder. This seems really bad for us. That seems like like going to kill us actually. Less heals. Flaw metabolism equals more food and water needs but more heals. Okay. I'll take metabolism. Uh, I guess if I get rid of Eagle Eye, then I can get strong. Melee attacks are more damaging, can create obstacle in combat. Get you a nice coat at first. You're talking about Dogman, right? I need botany because that may, lets me get the berries. All right, I, I'm okay with this. This seems okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna fight Dogman. You steal your nerves and decide to take this thing down, whatever it is. As you assume a defensive stance, it bursts into the room. The beast stands on its hind legs like a man, but has the appearance of a ragged, predatory dog. It looks right at you, shrieks and lunges. It con connects with a force that jars you both, and the dogman actually has to step back to keep its balance. Taking advantage of its distraction, you knock him to the ground and grab his throat. His claws tear into your flesh as you crush his windpipe with every ounce of strength you have. Moments later, he stops moving. You realize it costs you some nasty wounds, but at least you're alive. So, this is bad, isn't it? I'll take the dog corpse. Dogman corpse. 
the rush of adrenaline fading, you turn your attention back to this strange room. You should probably finish up here in case there are more of those things. Search the console. Not sure what this means. Trapping and glass shard on dogman corpse. Oh, I know. I know, I know that, that much at the very least. Okay, we're gonna get some broken glass. Um, and then we're, so we're gonna, sorry, the, the interface in this game still kind of uh, confuses me a little bit. So we're gonna put dog corpse on the ground, trapping and shard, and look at all that stuff. Wouldn't it be better, um, I guess what I should do is um, I'm gonna I'm not gonna I don't want to do this yet because look at all this meat I have to then take care of right. Uh, wouldn't it be better if I did this when I was able to like cook the, the food in the forest or something? He didn't take melee. <laughs> no, you're right. I didn't. I did not. So I'll take the glass. And we're gonna go, we're gonna find a forest. It would be better if I could find, I, like I in my current save, oh, I'm currently overloaded. I'm overloaded, really? How am I overloaded? Is the dog man that heavy? I guess I can't do anything with it. I have to, I have to deal with it right now. Okay. Confirm. Don't think you could butcher it without trapping skill. I don't think so either. So we we have our cool dog man. Um, I'm gonna keep the the gown for now, but I, I it's not great. Ash plus meat plus campfire cured meat lasts longer than cooked meat. That's good to know. Uh, I don't have. I need to go get some wood or some kind of storage. More loot. Banana t-shirt. Oh, yeah, bud. I want to get rid of um, the gown. I, I don't like the gown. I have tarp blue jeans. Um, digital water tester. Seems like a good idea to take that, would it not? Aha! Disposable plastic bag. You have no idea. This this one item has evaded my current run so badly. It's it's actually insane. You can butcher it, but you get less meat and you don't get full dogman cloak, just regular furs. So I'm gonna take this plastic bottle, which has some nice juicy yellow beverage inside of it, which I hope is good for for drinking is there any point in making a tent by the way it seemed to be like like make it um easier for people to find us rest plus heal the woods we need to we need to heal up a little bit. You can put the bag in the backpack slot. Can I? Oh, you're right. I can. Oh my god, I did not know that. You have no idea. The plastic bag is so good. No, nothing found. I, okay, so I just need to get some woods. Some woods. I need to get some wood. We found some mushrooms. I need some- I need some wood. Oh, I don't have a lighter. I just realized I, I can't even make a fire if I don't have a lighter. 
Tense affects uh, sleep quality. Better sleep equals better heals and more endurance or fatigue reduction. <laughs> I wonder what's weighing me down. Drops glass shard to offload him. <laughs> Listen, I wanted to take the dogman corpse really badly. Yo, we're blind? What? We're we're blind. Oh, is it just because it's dark out right now? Trapping is more or less a survivalist skill. I know we can like trap squirrels. Is trapping squirrels actually like viable? Minor bruising, minor pain, minor cut, minor pain. We need to bandage these up at some point. Uh, I wish I had a lighter, but I don't, so I can't start a fire. I'm just gonna keep moving, honestly. We uh, hear about the mat the glow. We're gonna go ahead and sleep. Disposable plastic shopping bag. Really? There's another one on the ground? <gasps> oh my god, that's so good. Why is there another one on the ground? Trapping squirrels is great. Free meat and furs for fur, fur tunic and fur gloves. Also, you can use trapping to make friction fires using only sticks and you can use botany for tannin tea. Oh. Don't eat human flesh. Gotcha. This game like a caveman, I don't really care about sleep effectiveness. I just sleep on the floor like a crap. <laughs> so, okay, here's my question. How do I make fur stuff? Cause like I've gotten fur before, but I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it. Weak with thirst, oh no. Okay, we're gonna have to scavenge the woods. <gasps> Is that a lighter? I just found a lighter, nice. And a pill organizer, oh goody. Tannity helps healing and you can use it to disinfect Wounds. Also, tannin tea is guaranteed to be pot potable. Not all water is safe to drink automatically. Even running water, you should boil it. I I, I do know that part. Um, I uh, I need to. I don't have a pot though, so I might have to just chance it. So if I oh I can't take this wood. I wish I could rotate items. <laughs> Um, I can take it like this, and then, um, we could sharpen a spear. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to put this in here, and, um, I'm going to take this glass, and we're gonna make a we're gonna make a nice sharp spear for us. Oh, not enough moves. I don't like that crafting takes a turn. I understand why it does, but I always forget that, and then and then I uh, have to stop doing what I'm doing. Okay, now we have a weapon, and I'm gonna leave the shards, but we're gonna take the wood. I want the wood for a specific reason. We're also going to take some of this here fire starter. And then I'm going to go back to the cryo chamber, cryo place. You have to have thread and furs and craft with all of them at once to make furs into tunics and gloves. Also, <laughs> tenancy can be brought, can be bought, doesn't really make worth the botany perk. 
Okay, so we're going to go to the cryo chamber because I want to uh, make some fire here. Oh, it's spoiled. Man, that was quick. It's only been here a day. Yo, real talk, chat. It, would you say that meat is not good to, to eat after it's been sitting outside for a day? I was going to smoke it. I was going to smoke that meat. Now I, I can't. Uh, okay, well, that's a problem. I don't have any water right now. Something is coming my way. Scan for area for hidden targets. I'm not seeing anything. It is a dog. Threaten. It's 26 away, so I'm going to threaten it. Frail, vulnerable. I'm going to continue threatening it. Retreats from player. Okay. I even drink unknown water from time to time. <laughs> Raw meat with no refrigeration after 24 hours. I wouldn't risk it. But it hasn't been 24 hours. It's been 12 hours. Actually, it hasn't even been that. It's been like 8 hours because I killed it late in the day, right? But you wouldn't risk it? You would not eat the... Uh, Dog man meat on the floor. We're gonna we're gonna we're, we're continuing to hide and I'm gonna hide my tracks as well We'll do a double hide tracks Lots of stuff on the ground Including the string. Here's what I like to do with the string if I get medium string uh, string like this I'm gonna turn it into long or short string Oh, we, we can't craft right now. I always make that mistake every single time. End turn. Oh, no. Sneak away. Does it know it, that I'm here? Um, Reveal self. Do they know I'm here? Visible no. I'm gonna, I think I wanna wait. How does dry aged beef works? <laughs> I think that, I think dry aged beef is just a little bit spoiled. Needs to scavenge some berries for his thirst. Maybe suggesting fast metabolism was a bad idea. Oh no, there's two of them. Wait, is it fighting us now? Oh, I am now visible. Demand target surrender. They're charging towards me. Take cover. Uh, tough, barefoot, vulnerable. Advance undercover. Are they charging? They're still charging. They have a chance to trip when that happens. Um, dodge. Tries to retreat from player, but can't get away. Demand target surrender. Uh, threaten. They're running away. <laughs> Offer ceasefire. There we go. Wear the dog man meat as a scarf. Dry age on the go. <laughs> Carries dry aged beef around in his arms with a lot of trash. Okay, let's go to the uh, woods and we're going to get some berries. I'm going to do botany strong with the, with the, that. Okay. Eating lots of berries, berry time. This is the berry song. Berry song. Okay, hold on. Uh. Our, our adventure, our intrepid adventure is going to... Check his text for a moment. All right, give me give me one second here.
I had to take the, uh, the dog man meat out of the fridge to ensure that it is fully thawed. It's a big mistake to not pick a combat perk. Either ranged or melee must pick it. As it must pick in my eyes. Okay. You can't just be the bard? I'm going to be the bard in this game and basically always uh, talk my way out of combat. Would you say that that is not a viable way of playing? I, I hear what you're saying, though. I guess uh, from what I heard about this game is, like, it's really difficult to, to actually win in combat. So um, for me, like, I'd rather just, like, avoid it for now. There's an, a feral dog. What does spying do? Like, if I spy, what does that do? Big is going to die. I was not even looking at if... Uh, were, the, were the berries poisonous? Oh, no. They were blue. I assume that blue means good. Is blue berries not good berries? Edible berries. I usually check to see if they're edible or poisonous and then I put them aside. These are edible as well. Ah, uh, that's... Maybe we should chance the, uh, the, the water. Can't talk with Dogman ripping in your guts. Can we just like uh, cook the poison mushrooms and then cook cook the poison out of them? That's how it works in real life. Phew, thank God. Oh no. We're gonna run. Oh, there's another dog, like, in the way there. Okay, we'll end our turn. Hopefully the, the other dog didn't see us. And they didn't. Nice. Let's uh, check out some crumbling... Uh, crumbling house. <laughs> Cardboard box. Yo, a backpack. Backpack, backpack. Yo, backpack, backpack. Check it out. Finding a backpack is just like such a good find in this. Roads and routes of Michigan roadmap. Yo, look at all the plastic bags I just found. This is a condition of this one is like really bad. So sw swapping that would be nice. Makeshift rag shoe. All right. Wearing improper footwear and is uncomfortable. I need to find some shoe. Combat pretty easy once you figure it out. Only dogmen give me troubles. And I can usually bash someone's head pretty easy. You can cook the poison mushrooms into poison mushroom stew. Can we use the dirty rags to, to craft some, like, shoes? Not enough moves. I always do that, don't I? Oh, feral dog. Conditions bleeding. Melee attack. They are in severe pain. Died due to acute bleeding in the lungs. So we should be able to turn them into something, right? Oh, we can... Okay, we're going to have to turn the broken bottle... Sorry. The broken bottle into some glass. And we'll take the glass shards. 
We've put uh, trapping here. We should get some more stuff. Small chunk of fur. But we need some. We need some wood. I dropped my mo my wood like an idiot. So if I put this here, and our string, where is our string? Do I not have string anymore? What happened to our string? Did I lose it? Oh man. Hey, here's a boot. I didn't notice that. Wait, what? Oh, left. I don't know what happened to our string. I know we had some. You tried modded Neo Scavenger? I have not, but I am I think you're talking to uh, Kevbo. Okay, let's try making a crappy fire. Um with some blue jeans. Oh, we can get some string from this. Alright, okay, this will actually start a fire. This will give us a shoe sole. Extended actually makes mechanics and electric useful. Good to know. So I'm gonna I'm gonna start a fire here. Because I want to, so what I want to do, I need to put water on this, right? We need, we need ashes so that we can uh, cure this meat. Alright, so I, I've turned the, the fire into ash. And now, I don't think I'm going to be able to turn this um, fur into anything. I have some string, maybe. Okay, we could get a little bit of string, but I don't know if I can, like, it, w will that be enough? Just find a forest and use sticks. I did that last time and then and then uh, the, the food spoiled. So you can make a makeshift, makeshift rag shoe. Could I make a makeshift uh, right shoe, not just a left shoe? I guess it doesn't matter. It 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 can be what you know. It's where whatever. This can go on ever whenever. Improper footwear. Listen, buddy, you don't really have much room for complaint here. I don't think I have anything else I can start a fire with, unless I could do this. I could start a small fire, but I need a big fire. Can I use the chunks of fur? Nope. Uh, I could burn my own jeans. Might have to try that. Electronics is a troll skill in the base game. I remember that. All right, I guess I'm gonna take the meat with me and then we're gonna go to the forest and try and cure this meat. I want this fur as well, but I don't think I can put it anywhere. Um, I could make a noise trap. I feel like I could make a noise trap, right? Trapping, was it string, and then a bottle, and then stones? Do I need small stones exclusively? I 
I'm not seeing any small stones, so I guess I'm done. So instead, I'll, I'll keep the one of the bottles so I can try and make a noise trap out of it. Um, I'm going to convert this into small string so I can carry it with me. Take that with us and then take another bottle. And, uh, oh, we, we want that ash as well. The ash doesn't stack. I don't know where that ash just went right now. Where is that ash going? Oh, it's going in the plastic bottle. Oh, that's weird. That's truly bizarre. Okay, so that'll have to do. We've got the ash. Rag shoes are a trap. Okay. What's wrong with rag shoes? They're, they're a newbie trap. They're bad. Edible poison. Small chunk of meat spoiled. Okay, we're gonna use this to make some wood. And then we're gonna make a big ol' fire. Big ol' fire. Okay, so if you have a tiny lit campfire, can you add wood to that to make it a bigger campfire. I didn't use my lighter to do that, right? So if I put this here, can I like add, ah, oh, there we go, there we go. All right, so now we have this, we're gonna add meat. And sticks and ash. I couldn't help but notice that it's not giving me all the all the meat. Big ol' fire, why? For the three turns in a row you get blisters and lower your move points by one. If you take them off but don't let the blisters heal you get two blister debuffs that stack. Okay. I'm I'm glad you you told me. So do I oh, Okay. There there we go. There we go. But why can't I turn the other why 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 am I not able to turn this stuff into meat into cooked meat? Someone want to inform me? Small chunk of meat cured. You have to do the cooking in steps. This is what I think about your steps. Not enough moves to craft, okay. Okay, so how come this isn't working? This is cooked meat, but I wanna I wanna cure it. Small chunk of meat cooked. That didn't seem to work. Trapping skill, ash fire, and I think it's stick. Oh, I've got some sticks. Do I need a big stick for the big meat? Can you not cure it after it's cooked? Raw meat only, oh, okay. All right, well, good to know. So we're we're good here. We've got, we've got a ton of meat on the ground that I gotta store. 
I don't know how long this, this meat will be good for. But we will eat it. It'll be fine. Tempted to drink some uh, some of this water. I know that's not the good idea. It's it's the bad idea. But I'm tempted all the same. Do we have some pebbles on the ground? We have no pebbles on the ground. Damn. I need to make a noise trap. I need a I need a pot. Poison berries. Edible berries, drink that. Use or craft to add more water. If only we had a pot. I don't have a pot to piss in. Entire game takes place in Michigan. I thought it took took place in Detroit. I just realized how stupid that's going to sound. I was totally being ironic when I said that. This game is just normal life in Detroit. That's what I heard too. Dog. Doge. Threatened dog. Get out of here, dog. Um, I say get out of here, dog. Dog, you better get out of here. I'm threatening you. Dog. Dog, I swear to, I swear to God, dog. Rah! Get out of here. Threaten. I'm being very threatening right now, dog. Stop. Stop approaching me. Stop approaching me, dog. There you go. <laughs> Goodbye, dog. <laughs> this Detroit is a city in Michigan. <laughs> oh, yeah, I mean, that's, you know, I, I wanted to let, you know, I, I wanted to ask because, uh, you know, other people might not know that. <laughs> other people might not have known that Detroit was in Michigan, you see. How come some uh, tiles are not visible? I didn't mean to do that. Ooh, pebbles on the ground. Perfect. Uh, we don't have any moves to craft, but the reason I need pebbles... Dying of thirst. Okay. It's, it is time to scavenge a stretch of forest. Confirm. Botany, light, strong. It's time to take a chance. Edible berries. So, um, chat, asking genuinely, how much would people care to watch any vintage story? Because I was thinking it would be uh, it would it would be like I don't know kind of like killing two birds with one stone because I wouldn't mind streaming it and also I could record it and then turn it into the series I've I've got three more episodes going up this week I know like probably most of chat doesn't care about vintage story but I'm asking for even the people who don't care how much how much would that interest you I'm going to take some a t chance on some water. And then we're going to we don't we don't have enough moves to craft and turn. Oh, something is spooking us. Search. 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 Oh god. Range 1. Fell on the ground and must regain footing to continue. Player is exposed to easy attack for a moment. Player needs a moment to recover before acting again. Desperately retreats from player. Well, that's 
a twist. I did not see. I did enjoy Vintage Story. I am shocked to hear you say that, I'm a tan, but I'm, I'm very glad. Tired of Neo Scavenger? No, I'm not tired of Neo Scavenger. I'm asking about next week. No, no, no. Don't get me wrong. Please. I, uh... Trying to survive. Okay. Trapping. And string. Where is our noise? I need a noise machine. Where is my noise machine? Thank God it wasn't a dog, man. No, for real, thank God. But also, how do I make the noise machine? Do I need uh, a long string? Do I need to put it... Botany? No. <laughs> would you consider Jupiter Hell on stream? I would consider Jupiter Hell on stream. Other things in the game are based on Michigan myths. And that horror ran from Big because he's wearing a dogman cloak. Everything is scared of what kills dogman. Oh, no. I Don't worry, Gavin. It would be better to do it on stream because um, I would have a better chance of, like... First of all, here, I, I need to... Let me, let me talk this through a little bit. Because, um, like, I like to, I guess, you know... Uh, pull up the curtains a little bit when it comes to how this whole YouTube thing happens or how it works. Um, the reason a lot of series that I do fail is because I, I'm, I am bad at them, but also I don't think it's entertaining to watch someone uh, A, necessarily get frustrated with a game. Yes, I know AVGN exists, but you know it's not entertaining to watch me get frustrated with a game. Um, and I am in a vacuum, I would get frustrated with a game like, uh, Jupiter Hell, mostly because I realize that like I'm dying a lot and it's not going to be good for business. It's not going to be good for a series. Um, the other reason is like, it would be better to stream a game like that because, you know, we're all just having a good time and it doesn't matter if I die. It doesn't matter if I die. 20 times because we're all just going to have a good time together and I think that that is generally pretty true um what is this oh fireproof waterproof container oh I need I need a source of heat for that um broken branch so that's kind of my reasoning there I I wouldn't mind actually um playing Jupiter Hell on stream because I think it would be better than trying to make a series out of it. Noise trap. Small or medium rigid container, small thread, small rigid parts. Oh, I need a stick, don't I? I don't have a stick. There we go. Now this will work. Stick, string, trapping, uh, pebbles. Oh, bottle. Still no? Why not? Why not? Tell me why not. Uh, noise trap. Small thread. I don't want to... Why? What? What? Is it because... No, I straight up don't know why it didn't let... It didn't give it to me. Okay, well, I did it. Sometimes sometimes the big simple is the big stupid, and I have to be okay with that sometimes. The hardest thing for me about Jupiter Hell is how I get into a rut and didn't realize I need to change strategies. Well, here's the issue, is that I change my strategies in uh, Jupiter Hell. Not always. I always find myself... I, I also find myself in that situation, Gavin. But, like... I'll also try change my strategies and I still will like die horribly. And that's kind of when I get a little bit frustrated because it's like nothing I'm doing is working right now. We have another Enfield horror. I'm going to threaten them. They retreat. That's right. You better retreat. 
So I think I want to hide my tracks. I'm gonna end our turn. We're gonna go to sleep, hide our tracks, sleep. Oh, I need uh, my noise trap. So we set this up, uh, and this will give us alertness. Is this good? Uh, do, is putting this here, is that what I need to do? My f preferred look in this game is clown mask plus dog man cape plus a broken bottle in my hands. Everything ruins. Everything runs in fear. Everything. That's hilarious. Here, I will sleep with my best friend, Stick. Player is thirsty. Player needs to shut up. Oh, I'm thirsty. I'm hungry. And my feet are cold. Yo, stop complaining. You know, if the post-apocalypse was made up of complainers, then then you would win a prize. Hey, if it's if it's raining, can I use a plastic bag to collect some water? That would be clever. I would be really, really happy if that was a thing. See, I, that should be a thing. Just saying. Trapping. It's not a thing. Oh, okay. Get rid of this. Is there any reason I should keep this thing, by the way? Rat says hi. <laughs> And back, hello, bot. I like your, um, like, trend of uh, coming by, saying hello, and then leaving. <laughs> it's it's working for me, honestly. It's not, I don't mean that passive-aggressively. It's just funny to me. Also, don't hug blue frog cultists. They have nasties. Well, if you watched uh, my very short series, that's basically how I died. Scrap of paper, it reads, sh tool, shopping cart. Pliers, mechanics, well, this is, does not apply to us. We do not have the mechanic skill, nor will we ever have the mechanic skill. I need a, I need a can or something. Time to go scavenging. Strong. We use strong, we use lighter. Uh, better jeans? No. Ooh! Scope. Aw, uh, it doesn't fit. Okay, we gotta we gotta eat this meat. Cause it was uh it was slowly but surely decomposing. <gasps> can soup <laughs> currently occupying the the can's contents is a soupy texture. <laughs> Man, this happens every time, doesn't it? I always end my turn or get to the end of my turn and then like oh you can't do anything else. You can't craft, dummy. We should be able to cook with the can, right? We can we can boil water now. Your hospital wristband can be used in some crafting, but it just takes the place of, I think, medium string. In there, and even in the city, I vaguely remember some club or some such. Don't use your hospital wristbands. It's the it's useful in story. Oh. I'm a tan hitting us with them facts. Them facts machine. Use two medium string on the scope to make makeshift binoculars. Oh, nice. We just found another scope. This uh, scope is kind of badly damaged. Is it worth doing that? Okay. So we've got medium. All right. So there we go. What, what gives? Didn't do it. 
Two medium strings on the scope to make makeshift binoculars. What's up? Didn't do it. Trapping. Athletic. Strong. Botany. Glass bottle. It can hold water. You boil. Don't call me a boil. Thank you. You can put them on your neck along with medallion. Stop it. I'm trying to I'm trying to make a binocular here. It's not working. If you get a can, don't use it on any noise trap or anything. Use it to boil water. No, I got gotcha. you. I 100% I, I understand. Next to craft is an arrow. Next possible item. Oh! <laughs> Yo, boy! I figured it... <laughs> he figured it out. Alright. Rifle with strap. Tell you what, why don't we do that to both of these? Uh, because we don't have enough string, that's why. Oh, I guess we can do this, okay. Let's do this to both of these, because they're both pretty badly damaged. So, we can wear one. So if I put this here, you said I can wear it around my neck? How do, how do I wear this? Can it only go there? Oh, I see. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Pog face at long last. You've been gasping for a pog face. Can we do anything with ketchup? Ketchup? Catsup. Ketchup? Cats up. Catch up. Cats up. Catch up. Cats up. Catch up. Cats up. Oh! Oh! Poggies! Can I empty this into this somehow? Is that. Uh... No! Why would you do that? No! No! Why is that a thing you can do in this game? It's just gone. It's just gone. Oh my god. Why? Holy cow, buddy. Just... <laughs> Just absolutely destroy me, fam. Just absolutely stomp on, on me. Just, like... I have, I, have, I have no words. There goes our cured meat. There goes our scope, our, our spare scope. There goes our can. Everything, oh no, we have our can. Okay, well, not all is lost, but damn. Just, just, like, why is that a thing we can do? Someone needs to tell me why I can do that. I cannot be responsible. I cannot be held responsible for this. I am so upset right now. Holy cow. Just just a hundred percent destroy all of my progress in one fell swoop. Just go ahead and do that, buddy. You can take off your medallion for a quick second to see what awaits you and hunts you constantly. Be sure to put it on quick after seeing them. Oh. Uh I don't know if I want to do that. So glad I was here for that. I'm so upset. Just like, just why? Why is that a thing we can do? 
Oh my god. Shall I go and try and kill that deer? That deer seems very confused. Weak with thirst, huh? Well, we still have our can, so we could go and get some water. Hey, so there's a there's a flat grassland. Uh, tell you what, let's uh, go and get some wood, and then um, we'll take the wood to the marshland and uh, get ourselves get ourselves a nice drink of drinky water, drinky drinky water, yum. Oh my god, I cannot tell you honestly how like upsetting that was. That was possibly the most upset at a game I've, I've been in a long time. At myself, really, not even at the game, just myself. Uh, not doing a good job here. We are parched. All right. All right, now it's time to make a fire. Hey, look at that. We can use the sunlight, maybe. Trapping. There you go. Uh, how come? Oh, there we go. Stoked. Stoked that fire. Okay, now can water. There's a way to do this quickly, right? Stack. I don't know how to do it quickly. I'm just going to do it this way. You can rotate items with arrow keys. I just found out about that. What? And it doesn't work for me. Not not right now, anyway. Um, how come... What, what's up with this? Why, why isn't it working? Oh, here we go. Water sterilized. So check this out. You can hit mash space. Um, I wish it didn't end the turn like that. All right, we don't need trapping. I'm I'm used to putting trapping in there, but we just need this. Water, 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 water. You can just mash the space bar and then you don't have to worry about that. All right, so can we put some water in the these cans. How do I fill these bottles with water? Oh my god! I'm a tan was not lying. That's a crazy thing to learn after several hours of playing this thing, huh? I'm a tan. Hey, I'm a tan. How many hours have you played this game without knowing that? <laughs> How are you carrying all that water in my mouth? Can I just put it in the bottle? I can. How much does it stack? Not very. Okay. Okay, that's it. That's all we can carry. That's okay. Drinky. Drinky drink. Make ourselves nice and not thirsty anymore. Sure wish we had food right now, but that's okay. The, the food is with God now. Oh my God. What is that? Is that a, is that a wolf man? Oh God. Oh. Dog man slash stranger's upper right arm with a claw. Cut stranger's lower chest with a claw. Okay, we're gonna go and ignore that for the time being. 
nice that they put a little bit of space between use and destroy. <laughs> yeah. I need, I want to kill this deer. Um, can we, can we kill this deer even? Like, they're pretty fast. I don't think we're going to kill the deer. Let's just go and find some berries. Let us go and find some berries. Yummy berries for us. Yum. Handful of yellow poison berries. Uh, these are edible mushrooms. Edible, 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 edible. It's all edible. Yummy. Let's uh, let's carry this with us. <clears throat> Dog man. Dog man. So, how am I doing, chat? I'm not quite halfway to the, the glow. I feel like I'm doing all right. All except for destroying all of my goods. That was a pretty good move. Oh, look, some hobbit holes. Do I still have my noisemaker? Or did I forget to pick that up again? All right, that's good. Uh, I could, do I have, I have some pebbles? I don't have any string, so we can't make another noisemaker. So I am unfortunately well scuppered. We'll sleep for now. Drink some radiated coffee. Players thirsty, uh huh. Okay, we're okay. We're doing. I, I honestly, I'm still happy that I have. I got that backpack, despite the fact that it destroyed everything. I mean, I I destroyed everything. I, I understand that I am the one who destroyed everything, but I'm still upset. Take a peek. What's world without the amulet no i don't want to do that we're i'm actually doing all right right now i don't want to like completely throw the run like you know for instance destroying my backpack with all the stuff inside am I, do, is it apparent that i'm i'm a little bit salty about that okay we're gonna move I like that our our, our uh, character model has a ba a little plastic bag. Has anyone played um, the new game by the dev? The uh, what's it called? I can't remember what it's called. The space game. I've been thinking about picking it up at some point. Time to scavenge. Botany strong. How do you feel about open world roguelikes? Well, Caves of Cut is like my favorite game of all time and it's an open world roguelike. I'm not, I don't mean that sarcastically either. It is an open world roguelike. I'm not, I'm not even being pedantic. Also, is this game not an open world roguelike technically? I don't know. It is a turn-based game, and it is procedurally generated. Is this game a traditional roguelike? Can we actually say that? Storage shed. Yo! Crowbar. All right, chat. Is crowbar better than stick? When am I going to find right boot? <laughs> I keep finding left boot. We got a cell phone. I'm telling you that it's not going to tear you to shreds instantly. It's actually a useful tool to cheese the game if you're creative enough. All right. All right, all right. We'll, we'll try it. Drop some stick. But tell me, is uh, is crowbar better than stick?
Cosplay Gordon Freeman. The best, the best part about cosplaying Gordon Freeman is that you don't have to say anything. There's no line. Technically, you don't even have to pose. Can we um, put a string around the crowbar to, to give it rough splint? That's not what I want. Aha! With strap, yes. It, the thing that I was hoping for is exactly what we want. So now I can put this on me. There we go. So now we can have both. I have two things now. You can make, tie the medium string. I figured it out, I'm a 10. I figured it out on my own. Are you, are you proud of me, Pappy? Red out. Okay, well, we'll wear that because it's going to get even colder. Oh, can. Do we want this can? Pebles. Uh, here's what we're going to do. We're going to take this and we're going to turn it into string. Did I just turn my pants into string? Oh, thank God. Listen, it's been one of those days, all right? It's been one of those days when you can accidentally turn your pants into string. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> uh, um, I want to make a noisemaker. Uh, noisemaker time. Okay, string. Pebbles. And bottle. Should I use this other can? I don't, I still don't know what the heck the, the what is the, the recipe for this noise trap? I don't get it. Do I need to split the string to get that to work? You might be not that simple after all. I'm, I'm the, I'm the big something. Looks like I'm no fool. Currently rewatching all the episodes of Love, Death, Plus Robots, and every episode I watch, I love the series so much more. It's great. Now I live in perfect harmony. Is there any reason to take the foil? Is that good for us for some reason? All right, we're going to take off the, the talisman for a moment. See what happens. Lots of stuff. I just found lots of stuff. Still no right boot. Found a left boot. Another left boot. Another shirt. So we have maxed out our, our layers. Another lighter. Water, digital water tester. I don't know if we need that. Pick up that can. Pick up the can. This can has soup in it. Don't forget to disassemble the trap to get back your can. Oh, I see. Shoe. I, I keep finding not the right shoe, though. I keep finding uh, a left shoe. So, oh, there is a sudden roar and a rush of dry air as blinding blue-white light bathes the area. Formless darkness begins to appear from within, and soon it emerges an impenetrably black silhouette, endlessly casting off fragments of itself. Orange burns from its center, pierced by the scattering fragments of black. It's already moving by the time you can resolve its shape, and its crude, chalk-white face is fixed on you. Uh... So I'm like, in combat, how do I put the talisman back on? Hey, random dude. Can I take... What, what? Put it back, put it back. Hello, random dude. So I'm in combat now. 
So how do I put the talisman back on? There's the wraith. Can I run? Desperate retreat. Range 25. Ra ra range 24. Run. Retreat. High chance of tripping. I don't want to trip. Okay, we, we ran. There's the Murga Wraith. All right. I put the talisman back on. It's uh it's still there. Does it disappear eventually? Eat the berries. Yeah, there's it. This is this is all that stands between you and oblivion. This little tiny gap here. It's the only thing that stands between you and destroying all of your gear. So is that uh, is that wraith now chasing me down forever, or was it already chasing me down forever? I think we got very lucky there. We're gonna hide, hide tracks, and turn. My t-shirt, my fairgrounds t-shirt has fallen apart. Oh no. Look at that, we're getting pretty close. That's some adrenaline in your system, right? Yeah, I mean, I, I that was almost the run completely thrown, huh? We're comfortable, we are thirsty, time to drink some water. Eat some berries. Can I do anything with this uh, cell phone? I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, I don't know what you're talking about either, Neville. Honestly, the split personality. It was and still chasing you. It's gone while your amulet protects you. Interesting. High tracks and turn. High tracks and turn. Okay, don't forget the noise machine. Pick up the noise machine. We can get our can back if we want. I suppose that's what we should do, right? Because that will actually conserve some space. So if I was to disassemble this into its various parts, what do you mean there's no items on the ground? Why Why can't I? Why is it not listing them? Oh, weird. Okay, so we can get our stuff back here. And then pick it up and all of that stuff stacks. So we get that back. Anything on the ground here? A tarp. We don't want that. I should, uh, if I find another location for some water, I should make some more water, huh? Can kill it or use it to get some free gear from unsuspecting Detroit guards. Yo, there's a squirrel corpse on the ground. Time for some eatings. Uh, bu 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 bu. how come I can't? Do I need just trapping?
Oh, I need a I need a sharp object. We could break our bottle, but I actually think it's better serving us as a bottle. I need a sharp object. What about the crowbar? Nope. So, I mean, here's where I get pedantic and say, hey, th this can is technically a sharp object. You can kill it when you're strong enough. What does strong enough mean? Do you actually, you don't get stronger in this game, do you? I guess I can't do anything because I don't have a sharp object right now. I don't have any uh, broken glass. What is this? Pile of rubble. No useful items. Found something. Another left croc. Jesus. We put on the hoodie. Now we're like super warm. Aha, there's some broken glass. Perfect. We're, we'll use that. I don't, I'm not going to go back for the, the squirrel. 73, 80. Okay, we're, we're fine. I was fixing my sleep rhythm and this stream happened. <laughs> oh no, I'm sorry. Um, we're getting pretty close. As you step into a clearing, you finally see the source of that eastern glow. It's a city, larger than any you've ever seen. Skyscrapers and their bigger brothers, Arcology Arcologies, stand shoulder to shoulder. Arcologies. I don't think I've ever seen that word before. Casting their glittering lights into the sky, hovering lights flit around the super towers. Like fireflies, a massive wall encircles their base with armed buttresses like glowing points on a crown. And radiating out from that wall, a shanty town of crumbling buildings, shacks, and tarp leantus. Hey, Colin, how are you doing? You get stronger through your actions you took on your journey. Get a new combat move or two that can take that race down. Relief at the sight of civilization almost overtakes you until you realize you still have to make it there. That and scavenging promises to get a lot harder near the city as nearby ruins will have been picked over already. So what that tells me is we got to get some berries. We need some berries. Get them their berries. More lighters equals more light. That's how that works. It's seven minutes before midnight. Oh, no. <clears throat> I'm sorry, I'm a 10. No useful items. No berries? No useful items. So what's on the ground here? Oh, some string. Take this bottle as well. Did Big just say, I don't think I've ever seen the word arc arcologies. All true kin in our cave. Okay, you got me there. You, you got me there. I guess I have seen that word before. Fair enough. All right, yeah, we, we are really not finding anything. I wonder if I should just, like, say screw it and run towards the city. You hear them before you see them. People, lots of them, pushing branches aside. You're presented with the city you saw from afar. A hybrid between shantytown, refugee camp, and RV park. Skirts the massive walls to the city. Everywhere you look, people navigate the winding, sorry, winding muddy roads, carrying supplies, patching holes in shelters, or arguing over their property. Smoke from a thousand camp stoves and barrel fires trail upward, and the scent of cooked food elicits a gurgling from your stomach. Nary an eye pays any attention to you, just one of dozens of ragtag corpses 
shuffling in from the wasteland. Beggars, customers, hopefuls, prey. Welcome to DMC's Sprawl. Arcologies are the skyscrapers in SimCity 2000. Oh. So, player is dying of thirst. Okay. Can we buy some... Oh, what is this? Unlicensed power tap. Used to add more charges. What? Can we add charges to our cell phone? What, what, what's the deal with this? 20 electric charge. What can I do? Can I, can I add? It won't let me add this to the cell phone. This is like maybe for uh, some kind of weapon or something that I don't know about. Stay away from those nasty southern black swamps without proper protective equipment and supplies. That's where chemical weapons hit. I need some uh, water. Player is weak with thirst, is starting to sweat. Co Cornicola. I have to assume that is, it's okay to drink this. Taste the corny refreshment. The junk market. As you navigate the winding alleys of DMC's sprawl, you encounter a huge structure fas fashioned of shipping containers. Throngs of people enter and exit the structure through a doorway on one side. Inside you can see a thriving bazaar where people trade scavenged items in the light of a thousand lanterns and bug zappers. The air is thick with sweat, smoke, and the smell of barbecue and spices. Uh, this is the Sprawl's notorious junk market. Pick up items you purchase to purchase them or drop items to sell them. Start shopping. Store policies. You head down to one of the crowded alleys. It's in a campsite with an average sleeping bag. Oh, look at all the stuff. Too bad I can't sell anything. Or buy anything. Makeshift sack. Half pair of binoculars. Hey, am I supposed to be using the binoculars for something? Or does it just like passively use? You can take a phone battery and place electricity in it. Oh, is it actually useful? So the cell phone is worth $11. It's the only thing I have of value right now. Caffeine is a diuretic. True. This cured meat. Cured meat is $40. Cheap memory stick. The data, data sells for lots of money. So if I had hacking, then I could basically use it to get some more money. Interesting. I'd really like to just buy a, a right shoe. <laughs> I give my left leg for a right shoe. Let's um let's buy let's buy some water. Could sell some of our lighters. This lighter is almost dead. Dirty rags are not worth anything. Uh, I guess 
I guess I can't really buy anything else. I could buy some sterilized water, maybe. Sell one of these bottles. Sell my vodka bottle or some of these empty bottles. Okay, we drank some water. Gotta clean your rags, big. You. <laughs> I do. I should I actually clean them? I'm not going to. I'm barely hanging on in terms of my survival as is. Navigating the twisty maze of shacks and tarp shelters, Detroit's massive walls stand as a constant backdrop to the east. Easily half a dozen stories high and pop. Probably almost as thick, the city walls are an impressive sight to behold. Armed towers bristling with surveillance arrays stand at regular intervals, keeping watch over the sprawl and likely the city within. Before you, giant vid screens on the three gatehouses flash instructions about pass requirements and threat levels. As flocks of people stream into and out of the gates, you take your place in line on the right with the others entering the city. You might find some cat pics on that phone. You're not wrong. When you reach the front of the line, a sinking feeling overcomes you. Heavily armed guards in full combat armor are checking attendees with some sort of scanning device. You're pretty sure that whatever these other folks have, have to get in, you're missing it. When it's your turn, the guard stops you and turns it to a monitor installed to, you know, uh, in the wall. A message reads, reads, device not detected, entrance denied. With the efficiency and compassion of an assembly line worker, he directs you away from the line back outside. Unfortunately, getting entrance to the city may be trickier than just showing up. Back outside, you cross the muddy square and stop to survey the area. Where do you go now? Would anyone in the sprawl know about the cryo facility? You're startled when you notice a man has been watching you. He's wearing a long brown coat and matching hat and is leaning on a walking stick. It's Willy Wonka! From this distance, you can almost see the glint of his eyes below the trilby's brim, though it's probably just your imagination. He takes his time approaching you, and as he nears, you notice there's heavy macalage on his face. What does this word mean? It reminds you of one of those old portraits you'd see in a history textbook. Folks call me Hatter, he says, matter-of-factly. I think we may be able to help each other. Come with me. If you did take out that dog man at the beginning with melee strong, you would get that city pass easy. Oh. Hatter's office is in the husk of one of those flop house hotels you'd see crammed between high rises in a busy city. It even has the old marquee hanging precariously from the cornerstones. Several floors up, armed guards watch over the street from missing six sections of the building. Hatter acknowledges the man at the door and leads you through a surprisingly clean lobby to an old-fashioned elevator. I have a client, he starts, pausing for the cage to rattle shut, who collects heirlooms. He speaks louder over the motor. He compensates well, well enough, in fact, that I'd be willing to part with the DMC visitor's pass in exchange. The elevator clunks to a halt and the door rattles open, revealing a dark room lit by video screens and old lamps. Stepping off the elevator, it feels like you've walked into a control center built into an antique store. Bobbles and relics crowd the walls and uh, tabletops, while video screens and computer consoles cast a bluish tint on a hand, handful of armed guards. Hatter crosses the room to sit at a broad, low broad desk facing the elevator. There's a lake he pulls a warm, a worn road atlas from a desk drawer, about a day's walk northeast of here. Inside a building, there is a silver urn. He pages through the atlas to a map of Michigan. My guess is that you know a thing or two about getting around out there. And maybe you could be, this could be your ticket into the DMC. He pauses to look up at you. Interested? Sure. What is trapping? Sure, but trapping. Something doesn't add up. You're no seasoned mercenary, but you're sure any fixer worth his salt is going to be careful with whom he contracts for work, and a visitor's pass can't be cheap. So there's no way this is just a cakewalk test. Plus, Hatter approached you. 
Nobody walks into a town out of nowhere and gets that kind of welcome. Something doesn't wash here, and it's making you edgy. I don't like this, you say, stopping short of sounding threatening. Sounds like someone's trying to set me up. That hatters, uh, that gets Hatter's attention. You hear the creak of leather as a guard tenses. And he says, leaning back in his creaky chair, it turns out maybe you are worth the extra attention you seem to have garnered. He looks down at a blank spot on his desk and considering something a moment he and starts talking at it. Your, let's call him employer, had a particular interest in you. He leans forward and starts interacting with his security console, interested enough to open this urn contract with express instructions that it only be assigned to you. Said I'd find you trying to enter the DMC. Said he'd front the cost of the visitor's pass if I got you to do it. He finished a keystroke, then gestures to the wall monitors. One of the monitors switches to a view of this room with a cycling time code in the lower corner. After a few seconds of fast forwarding, it switches to real time playback. There, standing where you are now, a black mass about the size of a man talks with Hatter. The detail seems to be glitchy as if there were some dark colored static distorted, distorting, distorting the signal, but only around the figure. What's with the censoring, you ask? Dunno, he says. Looked normal in person, must be some sort of EM interference. The discussion is short, punctuated by the figure handing Hatter a small object, then leaving. As a rule, I don't disclose client info like this. He stops the video. But you seem like a decent type, more to the point resourceful. And while money talks, I'll take a competent operative over cash any day. He reaches into a drawer and pulls out a small black wristband. This pass, the pass is yours. I'll keep my ear to the ground for any info on this Reaper fellow and let you know. And hey, he says before letting go of it, maybe you come around again when you, you're looking for some work. Re-enter Hatter's office. Where do I put this? Is this just a like part of his office? Tracking bracelet. I wonder who it could be. I probably the thing that I saw when I took off the talisman, I'm guessing. Wait, what? What is happening? Well, is that the 55 by the 2-0? Oh, he stopped speaking into a radio, disappointed at the interruption. What do you need? Uh, what's the story with the swamp? The boys. Chemical wash, he responds quickly. Nobody's permitted down there. Highly toxic. Yeah, but why? Some crops got out of control back in the day. Had to burn them with chemicals. His radio pipes up, and he turns slightly from you. Then he walks away, speaking into the mic. You're about to get loved tenderly. <laughs> DMC guard. Player is weak with thirst. Um, what What is the deal with these guys? I thought they... I have the wristband on. The gamer gear providers? Just you keep your nose clean and we got no trouble. Okay. So does this mean I can go into the mega city now? Visitor pass authorized. Ushers you forward and you begin down a long-ish stretch of empty corridor lined with harsh xenon lighting. Oh my god! This is really cool. I was not expecting, like, this level of animation and just, it looks really cool. What's the, the Red Gnome? An exception in an already exceptional city situated 
on a busy corner in gate 11. Neon Alley, the single story, streamlined diner, defies the densely packed high rises and elevated roads around it. In fact, several adjoining buildings seem to grow over the diner, using the precious space above its roof. Seems almost untouchable in an otherwise claustrophobic warren of glittering skyscrapers and patchwork overpasses. Before entering, you get the sense that there is something unusual about this place. For one thing, despite a prodigious amount of tagging on every surface, the diner is left unmarred, as if those around here know better than to try. However, that ominous thought doesn't seem to deter anyone's hunger. A line snakes out from a takeout window under a sign boasting, Real soul fool, food, real meat. I don't have anywhere near the money for this. Okay. So I need money? Crops got out of control and you had to nuke it. Nuke the, the crops with chemicals. Don't forgive. Don't forget get to give tips if you want to survive. What's your opinion about Elon Musk's brain chip? I think Elon Musk needs a brain chip. That's what I think about Elon Musk's brain chip. I think, and this is this is the spiciest I'm gonna get today. I feel like Elon Musk should be required to use any and all, and all of his own equipment, including, but also ending with his own rockets. With no return trip. So, where are we going? Am I not supposed to go east? Is there another map to the east that I'm not seeing? I like how we can see our, our journey all the way from the cryo city. That's a long way we came. Ooh, marshlands. Let's uh let's drink some water here. Someone really likes the elongated muskrat. Trip down a hyper tube. Yeah, I feel like there's several ironic punishments awaiting Elon Musk, including getting trapped in his own car tube as one of his Tesla vehicles uh, bursts into flames with no way to open the doors because they're like electrically engineered with no basically like easy or intuitive uh, latch. Moments before the vehicle crashes, uh, having disengaged its autonomous stupid AI so that he can't even sue himself. Anyway, what, what, were, we, what were we talking about? Uh, I don't know. We're talking, we're, we're just being chill. Chill stream, nothing but a chill stream right now. Nothing but a chill stream for us. Big upon seeing the f fetid swamps, I already said we're biohazardous. Ooh, let's drink some water here. No, these aren't swamps, these are marshlands. It's different. Swamps are ripe with good and loot, but once again, biohazard in drinking swamp water can give you soup. <laughs> All right, well, we're in the marshland. We're not in the swampland. There's a big difference. Uh, how come I can't boil this water? Oh, right, can. Sterilized. I want to partially defend Elon Musk, but I'm also a coward. You, you just did. <laughs> Feel like uh, any amount of of potential defending is is it doesn't take much, but 
You know, I'm not I'm not gonna fight you. What what are we uh what are we doing here? Oh okay, hello. Just keep your nose clean, I gotcha. Elon Musk is a giant. I uh I feel like this got this this got spicy. It doesn't need to be spicy. Let's go to sleep. Play this game as a misc of caveman and <laughs> listen, I can't read some of these words that are happening in chat. Cavehead? I can I can read cavehead. Player is hungry. We do not have food. The food kind of like disappeared. So are we going east or are we going north? What's a, do we have like a journal somewhere that, I thought I read east, but is it just north? There's no mark on the map. I know this is the swamp. I'm not gonna go to the swamp. Meat cleaver. Yo. Yo, dude. That's pretty, that's pretty popping. Pretty popping off. Pling. Wolverine. Oh, look at this. This is like highly valuable. Let's go sell that and buy something. You mentioned chugging any water you saw and getting into every fight you could. Waves, potato chips, can't stop at just one, literally. Storage shed. It's a storage shed. Uh-oh. You're hoping to find a hidden treasure, but that old cupboard turned out to be a haven for toxic black mold. You're certain some was kicked up by your disturbance, but maybe you avoided inhaling too much. We do have our, uh, our mask on which should help filter air a little bit, so maybe we're, we're okay. Hope I didn't inhale the toxic spores. Should I take a risk and grab that thing on the floor? Devastation on a monumental scale mars the land before you. It looks as if someone hosed down an entire country with toxic chemicals, set it on fire, then bombarded it with artillery for good measure. Pools of caustic liquid are everywhere. Most everything that once was here has dissolved, melted, burned, or turned to dust. H hardier materials have eroded more slowly, leaving skeletal evidence of small towns, farmsteads, tree trunks, and creatures. I don't get why why it's a bad word. I, eh, it's more like the use of the word is, it tends to be used fairly cavalierly. It's not that the word itself is bad. It's that the use of the word in, in very passive uh, chat or text is, uh, you know, could, would be considered by some to be problematic. I'm not saying you're problematic. I'm saying that if I, the streamer, read it, then it could be considered to be problematic. He's looting swamps without a gas mask. No, I've got my, uh, I've got my dirty rags. But anyway, I left. We're, we're okay. I think I think we're gonna get some more. We're gonna make uh, get some more water here. Can uh, but can you tell me which direction I'm supposed to be headed in? Because I I don't remember. There's a ton of ash here. Uh, there's no fire starter. Oh, dirty rags. There we go. Quality torch. Um, where's my lighter? There it is. Do we not have enough? Where is... How come I came... Oh, there we go. You got lucky. The lad or the streamer? I'm both, both the, the lad and the streamer. Okay, now we're gonna get some water.
And we're gonna we're gonna sterilize this water. With the can. I think I just I, I, I just screwed it up. No, I screwed up our, our fire. Damn it. How come this is not working? Rags. There we go. And then can. I always forget the can. What is that? Clean rags. We could clean our rags. You have to survive a year to cure swamp sickness? Oh my god. All right, let's uh let's clean some rags. How about that? That way now now we have clean rags. Look at that, we're, we're breathing through clean rags for once. So I drink some sterilized water. Put the rest in some of this. Do I have none left? Oh, there we go, sterilized. Okay, and I have one more bottle I could fill up with some water. Okay, we're gonna have to sterilize some more. Oh, there, no, we have some more. What, where's all the sterilized water that I apparently had? Where is it? Oh, I guess it's in my inventory. It's confusing, all right, all right. Get, interface is, is a little bit confusing. Okay, that should be enough. We'll drink what, what is left. There's sterilized water, we'll throw it in there. Um, can we, we can eat this creamy crumb. That didn't really do a lot for us, but that's okay. I guess I'll take some of this ash in case we are able to kill something. Uh, and then we'll drink some sterilized water. Sterilized, 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 sterilized. Okay, we're good. Um, I've talked to Elon Musk once, and I have to say that he seems a little, what's the word? Have you actually talked to Elon Musk? I suggest moving both, moving north from cryo facility and then northeast until you find people to hide coats. People in hide coats. Moving north from cryo facility. Wait, we have to go all the way back to the cryo facility. Are, are you really? That's a long way. I am definitely going to sell my uh, whiskey and then buy something, maybe. <gasps> Yo, sleeping bag. Is that, do you think that's worth it? Monkey wrench. I just, oh, multi-tool, multi-tool, actually really good. Okay, so we're gonna sell this whiskey. Only for like five minutes. The interface does get used to using, but eventually it just works. DMC is surprisingly not the first location you should visit in your run. Oh, I, I gotcha. Wait, really? Not the first location? 
I think I want to take this uh, multi-tool. Cell phone battery, nah. Universe smartphone. Creamy crumb. If I put this down, can I, like, do I get any change back? Oh, <gasps> saucepan. If we have a can, well, actually, the can is better than the sauce can, saucepan, isn't it? I'm thinking I might take some more bottles, although I guess I can get the bottles for free. All right, I want the, I do want the multi-tool. I, I don't know, like, is there any currency I can take? I'm gonna sell this and buy th this one because it's 100%. Uh, There's a big forest north which will help you get on your feet and explain some stuff about the world. Okay. Um, is the monkey wrench a decent thing? I don't know. I, I, I'm like very lost with this. I do want the sleeping bag. We'll take the sleeping bag. We'll take the meat. I kind of want to buy something just for the sake of currency. Am amoc amoxicillin. Oh, this this is really valuable, isn't it? Uh, cheap memory stick. I'll take I'll take these pants. Oh, the the pants have stuff in them though. I didn't mean to take the painkillers. Man. <laughs> Sometimes. All right. Rifle rounds, maybe. Eh. All right. I think I've gotten everything I can from the whiskey. You have $133 on you. How do you know that? Where do you see that? Oh, $75. Oh, I didn't see that. I didn't I didn't realize that. So this meat cleaver will basically mean we don't need glass anymore. We don't have to use these shards of glass, I'm assuming. All right. So let's let's get moving. Moving north from craft facility, then northeast until you find people in hide coats. So, should I be heading uh, back to the cryo facility then? Which will okay. So we 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 want to head north, I guess. We have some string on the ground. Always worth picking up some string. Or maybe it's not, I don't know. We have 20 string on us. Might be that that is no longer really a priority. We've got supplies. Having a backpack is such a, like, it's such a nice thing. Disposable plastic shopping bag has fallen apart. That's not good. I wish I had saved. I had. There's so many opportunities for me to to grab a spare. So that sucks. Well, what we're gonna do is we're gonna grab our bottle here. Actually, I think we can grab everything. We didn't. We, the, the shopping bag wasn't doing a lot for us. Still no right shoe. You're right. I don't, I haven't seen an opportunity to get a right shoe. Shack and forest. No useful items here, huh? Okay. <gasps> Disposable shopping bag. 
Oh, it, it's almost broken. Um, we can scavenge here. Painkillers are wearing off. Well, at least we gave our friend like a, a moment of, you know, solace. Edible, 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 edible. Where did they go? They went in the can. Is there like a button I can hold so that I can uh, auto take or do I have to right click and go use every single time? Use? No, that just, oh my God. <laughs> oh my God. I, I, I guess no. I don't need a right shoe. I need a right shoe. I desperately need a right shoe. Honestly, this whole story right now is the quest of finding the right shoe. The quest for the right shoe. That sleeping bag is absurdly big. You can get a smaller one if you're lucky enough. Hey. Yeah, I guess it is big, isn't it? Well, I mean, I, I'm, a, I'm a big lad. I need a big sleeping bag, you know? It's gonna make, uh... It's gonna make sleeping just very comfy. More berries! Both edible. Good. Yummy berries! Um, I could take a moment to refill our water. I guess I already have some water. So I guess I'm good. Oh, I should uh, turn this back into a, a makeshift bio uh, bionicle. I was going to say bionicle. Um, binocular. Binocular. Look at all the nice stuff on the ground. Lots of lots of food on the ground. Actually, at this point, I, I could start scavenging for food for the future and not just like eat everything I find. I know that's a that's a pretty wild thought, right? No useful items. That's the boys with the shoes. Them shoe boys I've heard so much about. Poisonous death cap. Almost ate that. Let's uh, start carrying some berries. What, what do we got going on? Sometimes you can't see what's in the next tile. All right, time to make camp. Put that uh, sleeping bag on the ground. Better sleep. Not so good awareness. That's why we're going to need to make a thing. Let's make a thing. Can. Pebbles. And one string, right? He did it. He actually did it. He's finally done it. All right, sleep. I loved Bionicles. Yo, Bionicles were so good. I I seriously miss Bionicles. Apparently, uh, Lego tried to bring them back for a very brief period in like 2017 or something like that, um, and they didn't they didn't really take off. They didn't work. Um, they they did like did not make much or any money, so that's a bummer. Oh, man. Really? Oh. Strong, tough, barefoot, blind, behind cover. Ah. Uh, 
We're we're gonna retreat. Range three. Oh my god. Blue frog preacher. Stranger is exposed to an easy attack for a moment. Can't get away. Um, fall back. Player is exposed to it for an easy attack. I am on the ground. Fallen, blind, strong. Get up. Dodge roll from target. Dodge roll. <laughs> um, get up. Player passed out from unbearable pain. Is bleeding. Is bleeding. Well, that's that. Ugh. Well, you can't say I didn't try. Uh, I, w c can someone tell me what I could have done better in that last, like, scenario there? Was I wrong to, wrong to pick up the noise trap? I'm just trying to figure out what the takeaway here was. Because, like, that pretty much run, that, that ended in exactly the same way my YouTube series ended, but with much more, much extra steps. Take a combat skill. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I need to figure out more traps, not just the one noise trap. I love Lego as a kid as well. I grew up in the 80s, 90s. Things were so much different back then. They were certainly different. You got ambushed by a blue frog trooper who was in melee range and he had multiple combat skills. It's kind of an instant loss scenario, sadly. So I just got very unlucky. I thought I had set up, like, prepared enough that I could have at least escaped. I thought that was the point of the noise trap. So I, I'm a little bit confused by that one. Also, was I using my crowbar? Like I had, I had a lev uh, quite a few weapons, but I'm not sure if I was using them. It was. This is a better run than my first one. Just bad RNG. You were walking around in one shoe the entire time, which lowered your move points down to one. <laughs> I kept finding the wrong shoe. The, the, uh, the, the, that entire game was about finding the other shoe. So, Astronauts. Has anyone played Astronauts and is it good? It's survivable, not likely, but I survived a couple of close hugs with blue frogs. Offer percentage of awakening early. It's not a guarantee. Oh. So it doesn't, like, let you know if a creature is approaching you? I've got a little bit more time before I have to end stream. Is there something else that we want to play before I do? Grandmother bought me a PC, 386, 100 megahertz, because I had a learning disability. Uh, astronauts is about a couple of Australians. No, it's Astronauts with an O. Daggerfall. I don't have da Daggerfall installed. <laughs> 